It's Vanessa the Crafty Gemini. I post weekly videos right here on my YouTube channel and in this video I'm sharing with you another Tuesday morning shopping haul. Alright, so you guys, if you've watched any of my other Tuesday morning shopping hauls, you probably have seen that I've covered a ton of stuff because Tuesday morning carries a ton of stuff, right? In all different types of things, I especially like to go in the crafts aisle, you all know that, and we'll get into some fabric things that I purchased recently. But this time, I kind of wanted to check out some of the other aisles of things that I don't normally even look to buy in. And so this time I chose the pets area. And so I did buy a few of other things, of course, I always stop at the crafts aisle, but I did want to tell you guys a little bit about the stuff that they carry in the pet section. Actually, it's pretty big. In my local store, it's about half of an aisle along the entire wall, and so there's tons of stuff there. And so I had seen it before, but I didn't really know what exactly they had. So I went the other day by myself with no kids so I can actually like read labels and take my time. And so I found some really great items that I thought I should purchase because I need some for my pets, right? Most of you know I live on a homestead, so I have quite a few different farm animals. And of course, we have three dogs. And so for the dogs, they're outdoor dogs, so they're not inside. So they had a lot of doggy beds and cat beds and cat toys and doggy toys and things like that. So if you have an indoor pet, definitely check them out because they were really great quality stuff and really affordable prices, of course, because if you don't know about Tuesday morning, remember that they sell closeout inventory. So it's great quality stuff, brand name items, and the price is super, super low. So some of the things that I picked up for my pets were these bowls. They're a good size for my dogs and they're stainless steel. So of course, it's gonna resist bacteria and they're better than those cheap, you know, regular old plastic bowls that you get. We, especially out here on a farm and since the dogs are outdoors, we always like to have everything that's stainless steel. And I saw these and they're pretty sturdy and hard and they're not flimsy at all. And it was only $6.99, which it says that the regular price is $18.99 on this bowl. And so I picked up this one, it's what? It looks kind of like a dark brown, almost black. Has some little paw prints and stuff and some little bones on the side. I think this one is more like a black color. And then this one I picked up is the same, but they had a few different color options. And so I got this one in brown and the same thing, $6.99, regular price $18.99. And they're called Bella, Bowl, Bella Bowls. Uh, it says veterinarian recommended, stainless steel interior, resist bacteria. It has a remover, uh, removable rubber base to prevent spills and noise. You know how the little thing clanks around or it kind of slides and stuff? It has this rubber grippy thing under here that you can even remove to wash out. So I thought they were great, good size for food and for water for the dogs out there. And so I picked up two of those for two of our dogs. And then I picked up some toys as well. This one is a spiked rubber ring. It says it promotes dental hygiene and they had these in a bunch of different colors. They're really sturdy and I have a dog that tears up Every toy out here, he's a pure pit bull. Good old Butterball rips everything to shreds. So I thought, you know what? I'm gonna get him this one and see if he breaks this one too. <laughs> so I'll keep you all posted on that. But this was only $3.99 and it's really sturdy and it's vanilla scented and the regular price is $8.99, all right? So we got this one. He loves to pull things and things like that. So we're gonna try that one out out here. And so these are some toys that I was picking up to look uh, for stuff that they can use outside. This is a roller bone. It's, it says, ideal for retrieving, toss it on land or water. It actually floats in water and promotes healthy gums and teeth, all right? It's designed for interactive play and it's tough and durable and it gently massages the dog's gums and cleans their teeth as the pet uh, plays with the roller bone. The little wheels on the side kind of roll. So if you throw it on the ground, it'll like roll away. And so it says that it also floats. So obviously I haven't taken it out the thing yet to try it. But the price on this regular price is $14.99 and I got it at Tuesday morning for $5.99. So I'm going to give this one a try. It looks like fun, especially for Butterball who loves to fetch. Then I got some snacks and I was really impressed to see that most of these snacks, um, they all say, most of them say like they're made in the USA. A lot of them are grain free and they really have natural ingredients in them. So I was really impressed to see that. So this one here is by, it's called Natural Reward Dog Treats. It says it's natural, grain-free, and gluten-free. I picked this one up because we feed our dogs grain-free dog food. Like it just has, for the most part, pretty natural ingredients. So I thought I would give these a try for the dogs, just to give them a little something. It says uh, it, it supports digestive health and uh, 
They're made with chicken from the USA, it says. So we'll give these a try and see. And so the price on these is not, this one doesn't have a price on it, but I think most of them were pretty much the same price, around $3 to $5 each bag. This one here, they're big sized ones, it uh, has duck and sweet potato. This regular price is $11.99, and I got it at Tuesday morning for $4.99. They're uh, jerky chews made with real duck, and they're treats for dogs of all sizes. And so we're going to give these a try. And so I just got a couple different ones. This one is grain free as well. It says there's no wheat, corn, or soy. So if you're looking for those type of snacks for your dogs, definitely check out Tuesday morning. It's really kind of like a random place to find these type of things. And so that's why I really have a lot of fun making these haul videos for y'all. So you can see what they actually sell there because I would have never thought to go in there to find grain free or gluten free snacks for my dogs, right? And you can tell they're really great quality and the price on these is really expensive regular price But then because Tuesday morning carries it at their closeout prices is a lot more uh, affordable, right? So this one is another one by the natural rewards Advanced with DHA it says it's natural grain free gluten free. These are little training treats So these are a little bit smaller ones and the regular price is $9.99. I got them for $3.99 at Tuesday morning then I got these ones. I wasn't going to get it. It was a little bit pri more pricier than the other ones, but I thought, you know what, I'll just give it a try. It's 100% venison, so that's deer meat, so they're grain-free, and it's New Zealand venison, and they're all natural treats from Superior Farms Pet Provisions, so that's a little baggy on that. Regular price is $15, and I got it for $6.99, but because uh, the only ingredient in here is the venison, I said, let's try it, right? Uh, let's see. Oh, that's all the ingredients has, 100% natural venison liver. So this is deer liver. I figured I'd give this one a try. It says no artificial colors or flavors, no preservatives. Uh, they look like they're kind of just dried, kind of like a deer jerky. That looks like what they look like. Uh, it says they're dog treats liver snaps. And these, again, natural, grain-free, gluten-free, and chicken, potatoes, and peas. Uh, gluten-free and grain-free. So we're going to give these a try, too. My husband's already dying to jump into these because he loves to just give treats like crazy. But I said, I need to film the video first so they can see what we ended up with without showing them empty bags. So I got a bunch of different little bags of dog treats. All of these, I read them to you. They're grain-free, gluten-free, most of them made in the USA. Uh, this one is 100% venison, grain-free. So if you like to feed your dogs that kind of stuff too, check them out because they had a lot more. I just picked up a few, but it was like a full wall with a bunch of hooks hanging that they had, tons of different treat bags and things like that. Then we went over to our fabric section and the crafts aisle and this time I went I was looking for something else Usually when I go down that aisle and I'm I really don't need that much more fabric If you all have seen any of my sewing or quilting videos, you know, I have a huge stash of fabric And so I kind of just glance at it every time I go on Tuesday morning But this time they had some really cool stuff that I hadn't had before and I figured I would use because it's something a little bit different Here I found these two bundles of Flannel, so it's 100% cotton flannel, and they are two one-yard cuts. So the two fabrics that you see here, this solid kind of yellow orangey color, and then this more uh, primary color kind of wavy line stripe type of fabric. There's a yard of each of these, so for I got two yards of 100% cotton flannel fabric for $3.99. That's two dollars a yard, okay? And the regular price is $9.99 on this. So I'm excited to give this a try. These would make I mean, these little packets are really great to make uh, baby receiving blankets. You can make real simple projects with them. Uh, if you have indoor animals or pets, you can make them little beds because the flannel is so soft. You can really use this for a lot of different things. And I got these two different colors. They had a couple of other options as well. But I got this kind of bright one. And then this one is uh, darker tones. This is kind of like a burgundy brownish color with some uh, plaid flannel. They're both, again, 100% cotton flannel. And the same thing, two one-yard cuts. They're one yard by the width of the fabric, which is about 42 inches. And this again was $3.99 at the Tuesday morning price compared to $10 regular price. And so I thought I would get some of these and maybe make my dog some cute projects with them. And then I got this. I'm not sure exactly what I'm going to use it for, but I was really happy to find it. It's 100% cotton duck cloth. And if you don't know about duck cloth, if you're looking to make a tote bag or like a market bag and things like that, that you're looking for sturdier fabric so you don't have to use interfacing or batting to quilt it and things like that, this is great to use for projects where it requires a little bit stiffer fabric that's stiffer on its own already. So for a lot of, uh, sometimes you'll find this in your fabric stores under the utility fabrics. So I was quite impressed to find that at Tuesday morning. I think this is a one yard chunk. Let me see. 
Yeah, so this is one yard, 36 inches by 60 inches. So the width is quite wider than the regular quilting cottons or the flannel I just showed you. And I only paid $2.99 for this. Regular price is $6 and I paid three bucks for it. Market bags, tote bags. Um, I think I could make a really cute like doggy treat bag to wrap around my waist and have like a little bag there because I wouldn't even really need to line this because the bag or the material, the canvas material is quite thick on its own. Then something else I found were these little fat quarter bundles because you can never have too many fat quarters, especially for small cutesy projects uh, to show you some of the varieties. Look at this pretty flower and paisley kind of print. This pink one has more flowers on it. This is kind of more of a modern one. It has, let's see, some big circles and things like that. Other flowers on this little brown one. And then this really cool, more geometric and modern shape. It's kind of like the chevron, almost wannabe herringbone type of pattern. But let's finish going over the fabrics I have here. This is another fat quarter bundle. Oh, let me tell you the price on that. So on the fat quarter bundles, I believe they were both the same price. So I got, let's see, one, two, three, there's five fat quarters in here. So a fat quarter, for those of you that don't know, is a chunk of fabric that measures roughly 18 inches by 22 inches. So you'll see that it's a pretty good size. And for small projects, they work out great. So this is one fat quarter right here for you, okay? And so the little bundles come with five of these fat quarters, and they're 100% quilting cottons, and they're only $3.99. The regular price is $12.99. So for four bucks, you get five fat quarters, which is a great price. And the fabric uh, is really great quality. It looks like quilt store quality uh, fa uh, fabric, right? Now let's look at the next ones. This one here, this is kind of like some stones. Brown, this is more speckled. These are more like natural looking, more organic looking fabrics. And they were just darker colors. So I thought I would get these for some of my male dogs and um, make them the same little bandana project. And then some fabric that I picked up here for garment sewing. For those of you that do garment sewing, you may be thinking, you know, what, what am I gonna do with fat quarters? But I was surprised to see they had regular garment, uh, or apparel fabric, I should say. And this is, says it's specialty fabric, 100% wool. 100% wool fabric is expensive, if you all have ever looked out there. And this is one yard, so it measures the one yard by the width of the fabric, which in this case is about 44 inches. And it's 100% wool again, and I paid $2.99. That is super affordable. The regular price on this is $9.99. And it's just like this brown and cream colored uh, stripe fabric. So I'm not sure exactly what I'm gonna use it for yet, but I thought I'd pick it up, 100% wool. And I found another one here. That they have a good weight to them too. These would make probably really nice pencil skirts. Again, it's 100% wool, the one yard by 44 inches wide, and again, $2.99. And the regular price was $9.99. So, you never know what you're gonna find at Tuesday morning, so check them out and you may even find some material to make yourself some garments, all right? So that's it for this video. I hope you all enjoyed it. If you have never been to Tuesday morning or you haven't been in a while, definitely check them out. I've included a link in the description box below with their store locator so you can find the closest Tuesday morning to you. Thanks again for watching and remember that if you wanna enter for your chance to win the giveaway that I do with every one of my shopping haul videos, the link for that is in the description box below as well. Good luck to everyone entering and thanks again for watching. I'll see you all next time. Bye.